something employees at the Spartan Hall of Fame Cafe will be talking about for a while. A man drove his pickup off a highway ramp, smashed into several parked cars, and even hit cars driving down Lake Lansing Road. News 10's Clayton Cummins talked with witnesses who heard the man say the devil made him do it. At first, I thought he just swerved off the road like, you know, normally, but then I thought he continued, so I assumed that he had, something was wrong with him. It was an eventful morning, to say the least, for Sal Burnell. He was waiting for his shift to begin Wednesday when, out of nowhere, a pickup truck drove off this highway ramp, smashing into parked cars. He was coming pretty fast, at least like 60 miles per hour. And then the way the fence is, you can see that he jumped up on top of the fence and it kind of just like crumbled. Like others in the parking lot, Brunel couldn't believe his eyes. Everyone was pretty scared, especially once he got out the car. And you can see his like his facial expression that he was just laughing and smiling. The cafe's delivery van took a direct hit, but it didn't stop there. The driver would make his way onto Lake Lansing Road, where he'd smash. In to five more cars. Witnesses there I talked to said the driver told him the devil made him do it. It appears that if he wouldn't have struck the uh, delivery vehicle that was parked in the lot behind Hall of Fame Cafe, he may have actually gone into that building. After smashing numerous cars on Lake Lansing Road, the suspect then fled on foot to this Hampton Inn behind me nearby. The clerk tells me inside the suspect asked for the room number 666. It appears that uh, maybe prescription medications or some sort sort of uh, narcotic was uh, played a role in what happened this morning. It wasn't soon after East Lansing police would arrest the driver, bringing an end to a rather odd morning commute. It could have ended up being a one car accident, but uh, ended up being a multiple car accident and uh, on only one fairly minor injury from that accident. So we're thankful for that. In East Lansing, Clayton Cummins, News 10. The driver is a 25-year-old man. He's now under evaluation in East Lansing Police custody. We'll let you know if he's charged with a crime.